What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Hensley Paranormal. We are at the Westland Cemetery in Cincinnati, Ohio. This is where it all began for Hensley Paranormal. This is the cemetery that I see my very first apparition. Um, when I was a kid, I think I was like 13, 14. Me and my buddy used to drive dirt bikes through here. And, um... One day, we was walking down the road right here, because this is the neighborhood I grew up in. But we was walking down the road, and there's this back gate back here, which will go down as far as I can go. But there's a back gate back here that uh, we walked past, and we seen a man. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. We seen a man, and it was a dog sitting at the back gate. I'm gonna turn this around so y'all can see. But right down there, zoom in. Right down there at the gate, down there, that gate. We seen a man and a Doberman Pinscher dog standing at that gate. It's like, no sooner as we were left out of here, because they used to be open and they used to be a, just a parking, a big old driveway thing. My buddy used to live down the street there. But as soon as we walked out, we turn around, we seen the man and the dog standing there. And then, you know, we, we turn around real quick again because we was like, oh, what was that? And it was gone. Like it disappeared. So So y'all. This is truly the beginning of Hensley Paranormal. So stick with me guys, we're gonna do a spirit box session here and I'm gonna tell you a story about what happened in this area. So stick with me. All right, everybody, we're back. So back in this little area that I'm in right now, um, me and my buddy, let me show you. See the woods back there? We used to have a clubhouse back there. And one day we was in the cemetery skipping school. We was running back through here. And we come across like a hole. You see how this got a little indent right there? But we came across one of them back there. And we looked and there was a little hole in the ground. And it was of a it was a little looked like one, you know them styrofoam coolers? Well it looked like a styrofoam cooler. And it, you see in the corner of a baby's head in that cooler. So I don't know if somebody just dumped the body there, the baby's body there. I don't know if it was a boy or a girl. Yeah. Let me so we'll sit right here. We'll run next room. Let's see what we get. As sure as everybody knows, Ohio is a Buckeye state. Well, this is a Buckeye shell. So let's go ahead and do a natural. Let's see what we get. Let's see if we can talk to anybody. Is there anybody here with me who would like to talk? I'm not here to disrespect you in any way. I'm just here to communicate with you. I don't mean you no harm. I just want to get your side of the story if it's possible. I was a kid, I used to play here. Do you remember me? I remember leaving and there was a man and a dog at the back gate. Is that man and dog still here? 
Also seeing a little baby in the ground back there. Was you placed there out of foul play? Can you tell me what happened to you? Oh, my camera keeps cutting off. I don't know why. But I will show you. I will show you what happened. I don't know if it was in the video or it got cut off. But there used to be a strip of storefronts and apartments above it, and there was an orphanage inside of the storefront. And it caught on fire, and a lot of the kids perished. So um, that's before the cemetery was here. I will drive by and show you exactly the location that was supposed to occur. Um, so we're going to go ahead and do that now. I'm going to go ahead and stop this. Thank you for your time. I enjoy it. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and drive around so I can show you what I'm talking about. Like I said, y'all, this is where it all started for Hensley Paranormal. Um, I've had some experience here. It's a nice good little size cemetery. So let's go ahead and drive to where the building used to be. Okay. Don't get all the way up. Sorry, y'all. Guys, bear with me. I'm not good at backing up. But I don't want to run over no Okay, so we're almost out. <laughs> Alright y'all, so we're gonna go this way. And I'll show you where I saw my So, 
as soon as we get to this T part of this road and we're gonna start to go down um, is where the building used to be um, but all around here used to be the big shopping center thing with the apartments above and like I said uh, the building caught on fire the building caught on fire and, uh, a lot of the kids perished in the fire um, allegedly there's supposed to be two, two, a, mar a marker for them for the kids that perished but I have not found it uh, there's also supposed to be a tomb, a, a tombstone in, stuck in a tree. I haven't found that either. So, but all on that strip right there, all the way down to here, was supposed to be where the building was that caught fire with all the kids that passed. So, I don't know. Um, there's a lot of graves over here. I don't know, you know what I mean? I don't know if it's true. I mean, I've lived in this area since I was five, and I've never heard of the, the shopping center that caught on fire. But, I mean, it's not. I wasn't born in the 1900s. I was born in 74, so it could be true. I'd do more research on that. But... So that being said, I hope y'all enjoyed this episode of Where It All Began at for Hensley Paranormal. Um, thank y'all for your time. As always, stay positive. And as always, happy hauntings. If you do want Hensley Paranormal merch, hit me up on Twitter at Hensley Paranormal 1. I do shirts. I got hats. Get at me, guys. With that being said, I love y'all. Thank you all for support. Please like, share, and leave me a comment. And peace. I'd just like to talk to you, okay? Can you, can you tell me your name? If you want, you can tell me your name. Did I hear Beth? How many how many are here with me right now? Now I came here a while ago and I, I was talking to some little kid back there in the back and you, you made my stomach hurt. Are you still here? Do you want to talk? Like I said, I just want to communicate. Feel free to talk to me if you want. I'm going to introduce myself. Can you do it? Introduce yourself to me. Um, my name is Bobby. So, <clears throat> thank y'all for watching this episode. I appreciate your support. Uh, and as always, stay positive. Stay tuned for another video coming soon. And as always, happy hunts. Peace.